In some traditions, it is believed that in the beginning, humans were a combination of both male and female, making each person whole and complete. But wanting to weaken humans, the god Zeus decided to cut each in two. These severed humans were left constantly seeking that soul that matches their own. It is said that when a person meets a soul like their own, they have met their twin flame, their soulmate, their divine counterpart. Because something magical happens. The two are joined together by love, by a sense of belonging. There is a strong magnetic pull and desire that ignites their biggest fears. This is something that cannot be explained, only felt. The vibrational pull to be loved, wanted, and desired only by that soul that matches their own. It's like a consuming flame that never burns out, and you are driven to return all these energies back to that soul. It's a pull to be greater than ourselves. And to that soul, I say to you, my journey has been one of learning how to see, sometimes for the first time, and others with greater clarity. You see, I already know you, and you know me too. Like birds to a feather, the process will bring us together. This will not be love at first sight, it will be love as first hearing. You will know me by my spirit. You see, we were not made to complete, but rather complement each other in our purposes. So we will not meet at the shore or at the surface, but rather in the deep, in the places where most people have never been able to reach, because it is there that the fullness of our potential is being realized. I want you to know that every day you are prayed for. And although you have yet to explore the studies of my being, just know that there are lessons to my essence, and I await the day that we soak in love's presence. I will always choose you, even when the tides get rough, because what God says is good, is good enough. In the meantime, I will enjoy my life and continue to serve in my calling. I'll see you soon, boo. I love you, and I know... You love me too.